A trend in birth control among states on the West Coast, giving some women more control and access to contraception. Two states now. Oregon and California will allow pharmacists to give out birth control pills without a prescription. There are many applauding this move, but there are some risks involved too. Did go and look up your lab work and everything was normal. And that is one of the big advantages of seeing your doctor for GYN Health. A doctor can order lab work and same thing weeks follow up both practices can now be put aside in Oregon and California at least in regard to the disposing of birth control pills and other hormonal contraceptive methods both states passing laws making it possible for a woman to simply fill out a questionnaire and get a three-month supply system says nationally this is a there's still a high rate of unintended pregnancy, and so anything that we can do you know, is certainly in the interest for everyone. This move in Oregon and California brings birth control more in keeping with, say, over-the-counter medications like Tylenol. They, too, have risk factors, but doctors say in regard to birth control pills, most women already know when they have a contraindicated condition. Women are over 35 and smoke. Um, women who have a personal history of breast cancer or any other hormonal sensitive uh, cancer, um, a history of liver dysfunction or a history of stroke or blood clots. Now your doctor would know these things, but a pharmacist may not. Still, doctors say there are less health risks control pills than there are with unintended pregnancy.